Hey everybody, welcome to the video. Welcome to the channel. My name is Mike and this is not our normal content. If you guys have been paying any attention at all to the excavation community on YouTube, the homestead community on YouTube, you know that Mike Morgan from Outdoors with the Morgans issued an egg challenge to a couple other YouTubers. And since then, it has just taken off. There are dozens and dozens of videos on this egg challenge and you should definitely check them out. They are all fantastic. As soon as I saw it, I knew I wanted to get involved. It just looked like a good time. I went out, uh, you remember that day we got rained out when we were working on the pond project? I came out, I set up a camera, I set up our Dutch oven, and I thought, I like the egg, I like the egg challenge, but I want to step it up a little bit and kind of raise the bar. So I thought if I can get some butter into a cast iron skillet or cast iron Dutch oven, I could fry an egg and that would be pretty cool. So I did it, it went pretty decently, and I thought, all right, this is it. I just have to wait till somebody challenges me and we'll be ready to go. And sure enough, Ed from Full Tilt Grading challenged me to the egg challenge and I was excited. I had the game plan, I was ready to go. But then I saw Andrew Camarada uploaded a video as well. And sure enough, the king of the container castle himself, Camarada came back showing off his culinary clout by putting an egg on a griddle and flipping it. And daggone it, bud, it was impressive and it was very, very cool. But I knew at that moment, we had to step it up even a little bit more. But let me show you the setup real quick. I got some coals cooling off. We're gonna set the cast iron skillet on top of there. We've got some buns, we've got some butter, we got a piece of sausage, and we've got one egg. Now I have, I have three eggs total. We had 12, didn't we? We had 12 eggs we brought down here to set up, didn't we? How many do we have now? Three, yeah, we got three eggs. So we got three chances to get an egg into that skillet, but the game plan is, I'm gonna try to make a sandwich. You're gonna not eat any more of our props, okay? That's the deal, we had a deal. Don't eat the YouTube props. Oh, yeah, I'm wearing slides, by the way. We're chill today. And I've got an old spatula, electrical taped up to the thumb. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna work, but I know it's gonna be a good time. I only have one camera. Neither one of my backup cameras are working right now. So, I'm gonna stick you guys right up in here. Hopefully you can see all the action. I do have the microphone on, so hopefully you can hear me from the cab as well. Let's get this thing fired up. Let's go ahead and set this on the coals. If I was real good, I'd set the skillet on the coals of the excavator. I just need you guys to lower your expectations a little bit, okay? And a little bit lower than that too. There you go, yeah, right around in there and we should be good. So I'm gonna add another spatula on here. This one's kind of set up for scooping, but I kind of need one for scraping too. We'll just have some double spatula action. Now we got some scrape action, some scoop action, of course set. I just gotta figure out where to put you guys. Skillet hot enough. Oh, she's coming up pretty good. I put you right there. What all can you see? Can you see everything you need to see there? Can ya? Where's that to? Yeah? Yeah. Pretty close. Tilt you down just a little bit maybe. So we had two technical difficulties during this whole thing. One being the microphone disconnected for whatever reason. So there's no in-cab audio. The only audio is from the GoPro itself, so it's gonna be real rattly. Two, the whole double spatula thing isn't really working out the way I thought it would. So I swing over here and try to adjust the 
scoop angle on one of the spatulas. And while I'm doing that, well, Charlotte's over there eating the sausage I laid out.
side getting a thumbnail right now. That's what we're doing. Probably I'll get the excavator in the picture too. Oh, yeah, there we go. Need the egg in there. Hold on. You gotta get good. That's a good thumbnail. Okay. Okay, <laughs> here's what we ended up with. Well, I lost a lot of the heat and my coals, so we're not, well, there's still some heat in there, Dad. on. Hold on, let's try something. Maybe if I get this back up on the heat, she'll actually cook. Here's where we're at, though. We got sausage, egg, and uh, some toast. I don't think it's gonna be a sandwich, but it'll still be a breakfast. What are you doing? Look, you can have the, that bread, that bread, butter if you want it, and those eggs, okay? We're working on something right here, though. Okay, thank you, she's such a good pup. Actually, we don't know how old she is. She's a stray that somebody dropped off several years ago. We've taken care of her ever since. Let me see if this thing will build some heat. Maybe we can get him scooped back out. All right, here's the deal. We're supposed to be working on the timber bridge project today, not out cooking breakfast. I don't think I have enough heat in the coals underneath. There we go. Some sausage, some egg, some bread. Definitely not a sandwich. Breakfast nonetheless. I don't know if picking that one egg up with the spatula counts or not. You're supposed to squeeze it between the bucket and the tooth, or bucket and the whole thumb here, but, you know, it is what it is. I hope you guys are enjoying this. Go just search Egg Challenge. There are so many great channels doing this. Also, check out Full Tilt Grading. I'll leave their description or their link in the comment. The words are kicking my butt today. Just look for Egg Challenge on YouTube. There's so many great channels. I've said it twice. I'll say it again because I don't know how to end videos very well. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next one, which will be the Timber Bridge Project. Mm -hmm.